The AV locator integrates a camera dolly or slider with a tracking system. As a speaker, or generally any target, moves across the stage or area of interest, the camera automatically follows them without the need for an equipment operator. Most camera dolly sliders are manually operated and yet still command price tags in the hundreds of dollars. Current market solutions that are automated are generally aimed at professional productions such as sports broadcasting, and as such, these solutions are prohibitively expensive to non-professionals. The rise of YouTube and the popularity of online learning has resulted in an influx of lectures and tutorials made at the amateur and semi-professional levels. The AVL targets this prosumer market. The current iteration of the AVL consists of an infrared or IR emitter, an IR receiver, and the motor assembly. As the IR emitter moves across the different zones targeted by the receiver, the motor is driven at an appropriate speed to follow the emitter until it has centered the target. In this version of the prototype, the motor drives a worm gear on which the camera platform and shoe is mounted with two stabilizing rods. Here we demonstrate the AVL using an alternate version of the slider mechanism on a wheeled platform. The platform can be seen moving to the left to center on the IR emitter carried by the demonstrator. While the audiovisual locator is currently aimed at presentation and lecture format for businesses and educational institutions, Online producers such as those that propagate on YouTube and consist of a small number of people or even a single person may find the AVL of use. Creating more dynamic and professional looking content can bring a rise in views. Additionally, productions such as concerts and plays could utilize the AVL. Without a camera operator, audience immersion, something vital to a play, will not be broken. The AVL could also be used as a secondary or even tertiary camera as well recording footage from awkward or impossible positions for a human operator. Because the infrared emitter operates similarly to the IR in any average TV remote control, multiple IR emitters could be used with different codes to designate individual targets or even send controls such as zoom and focus to the camera. Without a standard format for IR codes, any combination of targets and AVLs could be combined, allowing for imaginative and unique camera movements and effects. As development continues on the AVL, we strive to bring a quality product at a realistic cost. In fact, modularity will be a great concern to provide the proper product to the right consumer. The AVL will not just be a product, but rather a platform that can grow as the needs of the consumer grows. Whether that consumer is a lone YouTuber, a college professor, or a troupe of street performers, like the AVL, we will follow our consumers as well. The AVL, where you are, we, and I are.